Hello friends, so here we are with uh, we have with another question on Zener diode circuits and the uh, circuit diagram is given and we are given with information and uh, it has been asked to find out the range of input voltage because of which this Zener circuit will maintain a 30 volt across the load this 2000 ohm load resistance the value of the source or the series resistance is 200 ohm and the Zener current rating is 25 milliampere okay so basically uh, here in this case the input is variable and we are asked to find out the minimum and maximum input voltages vi min and vi max this range we have to determine zener current rating of 25 milliampere means the maximum allowable Zener current is 25 milliampere. And 30 volt across the load means maintain, it has to be maintained means the Zener breakdown voltage is 30 volt because only then there will be a constant voltage of 30 volt across the load resistor. That is the whole purpose of Zener diode voltage stabilization voltage regulation okay so here we have to use some concepts here no minimum Zener current has been specified so that means we have to take IZ min as 0 milliampere because nothing has been specified and it is needed okay to find out the minimum voltage we know that maximum Zener current is associated with maximum value of input voltage minimum Zener current is associated with minimum value of input voltage okay now here the load voltage has to be maintained at 30 volt the load resistance is constant 2000 ohm okay so the load current IL will also be constant because both of them are constant 30 volt divided by 2000 ohm okay so it is 15 milliampere okay the constant value of load current 15 milliampere that is always constant so here in order to find out the range of input voltage we have to consider both cases in minimum input maximum in, uh, maximum input okay so in case of minimum input we'll use minimum Zener current in case of maximum input we'll use maximum Zener current so the basic KVL equation will be something like this vi this is r this is vz equals to 30 volt so here the value of this current flowing through the series resistor that will change when the input voltage is minimum in that case I will be IZ min plus load current which is constant IZ min is 0 load current is constant which is 15 milliampere that is 15 milliampere in that case I is equal to 15 milliampere this is when VI min is equal to the minimum range 
that the minimum value of the input is considered. So in this case, when we apply KVL, it will be VI min minus 15 milliampere into R minus 30 is equal to 0. The value of R is how much? 200 ohm. Okay, it is 200 ohm. So it is VI min is equal to 15 milliampere into 200 ohm plus 30. So this is 30 plus this will be 3. So it is 33 volt. This is the minimum value of input voltage. Okay, this. This is the minimum value of input voltage. Then we will consider the maximum voltage. So in case of maximum Vi max, in that case that corresponds to maximum value of Zener current because this is the correlation Iz max, Vi max, Iz min, Vi min. Maximum input causes maximum Zener current, minimum input causes minimum Zener current. So in this case, this current flowing through the series resistor is Iz max plus constant load current. The maximum value of Zener current is the Zener current rating which is 25 milliampere. and the constant load current which flows is equal to 15 milliampere that is equal to 40 milliampere so in this case the KVL equation here will be like this VI max minus 40 into R which is equal to 200 ohm 40 milliampere into 200 ohm this always pay attention to the units otherwise mistakes will happen that's why I deliberately wrote milliampere and ohm minus 30 is equal to 0 that implies VI max is equal to this will be 8 plus 30 which is equal to 38 volt VI max is equal to 38 volt okay so the range of variation of this variable input voltage is 33 to 38 volt this it is a variable input voltage so here the important thing is to understand the correlations first and most important thing is to understand when the input voltage is maximum Zener current is maximum when the input voltage is minimum Zener current is minimum so when you are considering maximum Zener current you have to be clear that in that case the input voltage will be maximum when you are considering minimum Zener current in that case the input voltage will, have, will be at its minimum value. Next is to figure out what is the maximum Zener current, what is the minimum Zener current. Nothing has been specified directly here. Zener current rating means it is the maximum allowable current that can flow through the Zener diode. That is the Iz max 25 milliampere. Nothing has been specified related to minimum Zener current and we have to assume that the minimum Zener current is 0 milliampere. That is when the minimum input will be applied. Next, load resistor is constant, it is fixed load variable input, variable input fixed load condition. As load resistor is constant and 30 volt is maintained across it, so in that case the constant load current that will flow through it is 30 volt by 2000 ohm which is 15 milliampere. Always pay attention to the units. Okay, so next is to determine using KVL equation what this circuit will be. So here this current I which flows 
okay this current i which flows through the series register it gets divided into iz and il since iz and il are fluctuating between uh, iz is fluctuating between minimum and maximum values so the value of i will be different when input is at its minimum value and when it at its maximum value so when we consider the minimum input we have to determine the minimum input in that case we have to use the minimum zener current which is zero load current is constant so i is simply iz min plus il constant for minimum case that is 15 milliampere when we have to consider the maximum input voltage okay maximum in input voltage in that case we have to use the maximum zener current which is 25 milliampere so in that case when in the input is maximum the value of this current i is iz max plus constant load current which is 25 plus 15 which is 40 milliampere and we use the same value to determine the maximum input voltage so the minimum input voltage is 33 volt the maximum input voltage is 38 volt so always be aware of what affects what okay input voltage affects zener current and any change in zener current will cause or will it will affect the value of this current flowing through the series resistor so there are different conditions fixed input fixed load variable input fixed load fixed input variable load we have discussed a lot of questions previously so you can refer to those questions also to understand what is the difference between each circuit okay so here we have discussed this question